Hello, my name is Brandon with RPG Overviews, and today we're going to be looking at a solo journaling game called The Others, which uh, I have no, I had no clue what a solo journaling game is. I'm not 100% sure I still know what it is, but let's take a look at it. It's available on Drop the RPG. It's pay what you want. I'll have a link down in the description as well as a pinned comment. Uh, it's got this old art right here. I like the art. Of course, I love mo most old art. And so what it says is it's a solo journaling game that puts the player in the shoes of someone who has to gather as much information as they can about a newly emerging threat that nothing is known about. So it says it's based on the mechanics and questions of t two graves unknown. To play it, you need to record the answers, pen and paper, text file, your cell phone, whatever. And you need seven dice, three dice for the enemy's line of investigation, two dice for the threat's line of investigation, and two dice for the hopes line investigation. So what it is, is you need to find out that the others are among us and who are they, where they come from and what threat they pose are some of the concerns raised by the, their arrival, but you want or need to gather all the information you can about them. It won't be easy and it will probably be dangerous. So what is going to be the others? This line of, so you have the three different lines, the enemy, the threat and the hope. So this line of investigation, seeks to identify who the others are. Are they aliens, zombies, androids, explorers from distant lands? Where did they come from or how were they created? So this is where you're going to have to just come up with it on your own. This is a lot of like pulling imagination and ideas from your head to create these things. You've got the threat, the threat, this line of investigation seeks to identify what threat the others pose. So that's in, in, interesting. Of course, do they intend to exterminate us? Do they want to enslave us? um or something other hope is it seeks to identify how we can survive the threat that the others represent so what's your setup you separate your dice of course i'd probably do different colors um you choose the recording medium determine who your character is and answer the three questions below regarding the three lines of investigation so maybe you're a reporter or um maybe you're a police officer a private investigator or somebody with the government so the questions are, who are the others? What threat do they pose? And how, if at all possible or necessary, to defeat them? Obviously, kind of the same thing from the three lines of investigation. Keep in mind that what each line of investigation represents, but leave it to delve into them during the game. So you're answering questions. It takes place in rounds, and each one, a question must be answered. To find out which question to answer, roll the dice for all lines of investigation simultaneously. The highest number will determine the question and the perspective, the perspective under which it must be answered. So I do like the fact that it's got examples of you, how you make your roll. So you roll all those dice together. Hope's got the most with seven. And so you, the player will have to answer the question number seven under the uh, perspective of the hope line of investigation. And then it tells you what happens uh, when that's done it, the line of investigation has it pretty much is going to go down one it's going to lose a die so not just a you know uh, a, a roll but actually lose a die so you'll start more than likely having to answer the other questions and then it tells you what happens should you only have one uh die left it's only going to pretty much roll a one once it's the last die available that way you answer those other questions so uh it says finishing the game. The game will end when you have no other questions to answer. So here are all the questions. Um, so what have you discovered that was unusual or disturbing about this line of investigation? How does following this line of investigation put you or someone you care about in danger? These are just some I'm just picking off here. How are you harmed or betrayed by someone involved in the investigation? So, and there's the back of it there. So it's a very interesting game, I guess. It's more of like a way to come up with information or maybe a to me almost see it as like a way to maybe begin uh an adventure a campaign a game whatever the case may be with you rolling these things up to give you uh, pretty much a villain in your uh maybe your other game or since it says solo journaling and i said if you know more about solo journaling game you maybe let me know in the comments because I, I honestly i'm completely clueless here uh, it's a way for you to just be creative and come up with some stuff. So there it is. There's the others. Uh, pay what you want. Check it out if that's interesting to you. Um, and if you do know about solo journaling, let me know. Thanks.